everyone, this is Miss Angelina from Lavi School of English Language. I am an IELTS coach and a language trainer. I'm here with Hasif today to conduct a speaking task with him. And I'm going to ask him some questions related to media and news. Let's get started. Hasif, are you ready? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am, I'm ready. All right. Do you believe everything you read in the newspapers? Uh, yes, ma'am, uh, I believe so because a uh, newspaper is a uh, good way, good source to communicate people and like uh, it's the best way uh, to uh, educate and like to you have to know everything what's going on around the globe. So I believe so pretty much. How do most people get their news in your country? Ma'am, there are basically there are different source to uh, there is different source to uh, to be informative. Like uh, uh, now, things are pretty much changed. Like they are now you have your own mobile phone, you can uh, uh, get to know whatever you want. Like Google News and uh, social media. Mm -hmm. So basically, different different sources uh, in my country where we can easily attain whatever we want. Okay. How do you think people will get their news in the future? Ma'am, due to the advancement in technology, now people now, pe now, now people do not have much time to go to the market and buy a newspaper. Now they have their own mobile phone. Mm. They can easily just search whatever they want and just easily to be informative and whatever they want and they just easily assess now they are easily accessible so i think so like uh, uh, this is an era of technology and advancement in technology mm. now we now we are not uh, we have no so much difficulty mm. so like uh, this sort uh, in technology really matters a lot all right how has tv changed our lives TV has a great immense in our life. Like, uh, <clears throat> uh, to be honest, uh, it's the best way. Like, uh, if you uh, if you want uh, if you are feeling bored or if you want to be entertain yourself now, ju ju just switch on your uh, TV. Mm -hmm. And uh, if you are sports lover, just uh, uh, just go to the sports channel. If you want to be to know what's going on around the globe. We just uh, saw the news uh, news channel, and if you want uh, some sort some sort of, uh, if you are very uh, state, status conscious, there are some some channels in which you can easily assess uh, what is going wrong. So, uh, if, from different perspective, uh, from different different uh, perspective of life, mm -hmm. like people who don't who want who who whatever they want to uh, know the know and whatever they want to uh, gain knowledge. So t basically, TV is the best way to to be whatever you want. All right. My next question to you is: Do you think TV influences the way we think? Yeah. Yes, I think so. TV really influences you because, mm -hmm. uh, like, uh, like I said earlier, like, uh, uh, it really matters. Like, whatever you want and whatever you want to know information, mm -hmm. like. Uh, and also it really depends on your life as well like uh, it really uh, know what is going on around the globe and also uh, uh, it, if you live in a rural urban life like uh, and uh, if you have you don't know what's going on around the globe like yeah. it's really uh, uh, if you have a tv yeah. like it really matters a lot like you be, you have to be very, you are very into in, you are very informed you can get a, easily assessed and you can get a, a knowledge as well what is going on around the globe all right all right should children be allowed to watch a lot of tv no children should not allow to watch a lot of tv because uh, mm. if they uh, if they uh, watch uh, tv all the time uh, they then they will uh, then they will not uh, be able to uh, know uh, they will not be able to uh, uh, to keen, uh, to keen, uh, to know about uh, to study uh, to do study as well mm. 
like their study uh, their study timing really uh, effect mm. so i think there should be a specific time table for them like if they uh, there should be one to two hour uh, in which they, they, they just uh, saw tv and the rest of the time they should uh, uh, they should uh, to do diff- different activities physical ac- activities and they should uh, uh, some spend some time with their family as well mm. and also should be, be a specific time table for everything all right my next question to you is are all people on tv famous uh no i don't think so people are on tv are famous look because uh, uh, there is a trend like uh, 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 basically this is a era of fashion and uh, uh, like uh, modernization yeah. so like uh, you can see uh, uh, due to advancement in technology and uh, and uh, like uh, uh, different sort of uh, 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 technology as well mm. so i think like there is there is so much celebrities uh, famous celebrities yeah. so i think so like uh, it's a trend for them mm-hmm. not for the old people mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. my next question to you and the last question to you is do you think famous people have a responsibility to act as role models for the younger generation yes i i'm pretty much sure i'm pretty much say that young famous celebrity should be a role model because you are the uh, uh, <coughs> famous for uh, like uh, uh, they have their fan following and they whatever they do uh, their fan also want to do so like if you are if you are doing some good deeds so uh, uh, your fan also following them mm-hmm. and there is a good environment for them and also there there should be a environment in which uh, the good things are going so in the society as well all right well this is the end of the speaking task with hasib thank you so much for participating and that was of course his 7.5 band speaking not bad at all not bad at all this is angelina and i'm here with osama today to conduct a speaking task with him i'll be having a discussion about society osama are you ready Yes ma'am. What social problems are there in your country? Ma'am, I think so poverty is the major problem mm-hmm. in my country. As you know, the economic factor there are two types of economic things, you know, socialism and capitalism. Mm-hmm. You no, know, in capitalism everything is controlled by public the prices and you know the distribution of wealth. Mm-hmm. and in and in socialism government controls all the things but in pakistan we uh, we have capitalization system mm. where each and everything is controlled by an individual or a group of people mm. so that's why poverty is increasing day by day mm. Mm. this is the major problem which we are facing in our country My next question to you is what can be done to alleviate poverty? Ma'am obviously like uh, uh, rest of the world uh, the uh, socialism should be introduced in Pakistan where each and everything should be owned by the state and the price should be controlled by the states so the the distribution of wealth mm. will be in an equilibrium position mm. so more people get money mm. or the re- 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 the rich people will be you know on a hmm. said level hmm. so in this way the distribution of wealth will be in you know good way hmm. and poverty can be reduced all right thank you my next question to you is are there many charities in your country yes ma'am there are many charity programs or you know ngos are working uh, most of them are working for the poor hmm. or needy mm-hmm. persons mm-hmm. so i think they are working good mm-hmm. or in a way mm-hmm. okay my next question to you is what is the difference between major crime and minor crime yes ma'am i think so what i think that major and minor crime it, 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 there is a difference mm-hmm. uh, minor crime is when i am uh, doing uh, or a person is doing against an individual mm-hmm. this is can see is a minor crime 
and major time is when a person is doing with the state or uh, with you know all the people around the country like if i heard someone hmm. so it is between me and him hmm. but if i hmm. do not pay the tax hmm. is the way that i am doing this honesty with all the people living around my country hmm. so this is you know, this we can call major crime My next question to you is do you think all criminals should go to prison? No ma'am uh, like it, it depends upon the nature of crime which they have done. Hmm. 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 So, uh, there is you know uh, is not that much uh, hmm. bad hmm. They, they should be counsel or they, there should be a counseling session for them hmm. and they have done anything that is you know beyond the books or anything which cannot be forbid- forbidden so they should be sent to jail hmm. 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 okay my next question to you is why do so many people move to live in the cities M- ma'am in cities we have a uh, good opportunities hmm. and we have a lot of resources here uh, you know everything is well settled in city as compared to you know the backward areas or rural areas so here we, you have a good opportunities for business or for job so that's why people are moving towards big cities mm-hmm. for a good career or for a bright future okay what problems does overpopulation cause Yes, when uh, lots of problem mm-hmm. over population, mm-hmm. uh, like you know, uh, uh, lack of resources, mm-hmm. you know, mm-hmm. uh, uh, let's say you, we we will face that you know the uh, when population is more, we don't have more houses mm-hmm. to live. Mm-hmm. So, mm-hmm. There are many other factors mm-hmm. which you can. Mm-hmm. 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 That's right. That okay. Okay. Yes, well, this is the end of the speaking task with the summer summer. You did a really good job, but we need to talk more about um, the social problems in New York country. You know, we need to talk about what kind of problems are there, because uh, social problems are m- very much related to bribery, corruption, or you know, um, just, just, falsification. I know many of them. Just just them. You know. Yeah, all of these. So probably that was not a very good answer, but you did a good job, and um, we needed more of what could be done to reduce poverty. We needed more of that, major and minor uh, crime kind of thing. You know, I'm not kind of sure about that. Like there are two dimensions to this question. If you will talk about it, minor crime is such a crime where you you would probably not be punished. You know. very harshly you know theft or you've done something so probably you'd just pay some fine or something or some penalty for that and and you'd be free but major crimes are like for that you have death penalty right so uh, another another dimension to this one is uh, is minor crime could be taken as crime committed by a person who is not 18 years old Okay, we call it juvenile crime. That person cannot be punished. You know, even if that person has committed rape or murder or anything like that. So in most of the countries, even in your country as well, juvenile crime is not punished until uh, the guy or the girl is 18 plus. This is Angelina and I'm your interlocutor for the IELTS speaking task. I'm here with Farva today and Farva is going to take her IELTS speaking task with me and we are going to discuss about travel. So Farva, are you ready? Yes. Why do some people prefer to travel abroad rather than in their own country? There could be many reasons for them, but I think uh, um mm-hmm. is just because of their choices mm-hmm. they made uh, they do not want to uh, travel locally they want to travel abroad mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. that's it 
Yes. So do you think traveling to another country can change the way people think? Uh, yes, I think people, uh, the way of thinking of people can be changed uh, uh, in the area they are living or in the population they are living, uh, they are looking at different things uh, according to their mindset from their uh, beginning. Uh, when they travel to somewhere, they see the different kind of people, the different kind of, uh, uh, the way of living, uh, the way of earning and many things. Uh, mm -hmm. So it is the reason it can be changed, the way of their thinking. All right. Okay. All right. My next question to you is, do you think it is good for children to experience life in a foreign country? Why do you think like that? Uh, now I think uh, children, uh, if they travel to uh, foreign countries, uh, uh, they will not be able to understand the feasibilities of their own country, like the studies, the culture, and uh, uh, you can say the moral values of their uh, country. Uh, they will not be able to have that. But definitely it will be a different adventure or something, uh, different things to learn from the other countries. Uh, mm. Okay. You can say it would be a different experience okay, for them. My next question to you is how have holidays changed over the past few decades? Uh, from many uh, years, people, uh, mm -hmm. uh, before that, people used to travel to their uh, like. Uh, home to home like uh, your relatives or to uh, their friends only but uh, now it has been changed a lot like people you now like to travel to uh, other cities or other countries to uh, before their uh, holidays they uh, set up their schedule for uh, to uh, you can say mm. uh, to go somewhere in the any island or any northern areas or anywhere they like to so they have many different choices to go and they like to go there my last question to you is do you think it is safer to travel now than in the past and why can you repeat i didn't hear you My next question to you is, do you think it is safer to travel now than in the past? Uh, yes, it is more safer now because there are uh, many different uh, securities nowadays. Uh, uh, you could be dragged or you could be found if you've uh, lost somewhere or uh, <clears throat> something happened to you during travel, uh, when you uh, travel along to somewhere. Uh, there are many sources now that uh, there are many things uh, you can say with the things, with the transport uh, and with the, you know, securities. Mm -hmm. okay. It's more, more safer now. Okay. Well, this is the end of the speaking task with Farva and that was not a bad attempt at all. But this wasn't a seven band. This was about a 6.5 band discussion section. Thank you so much for participating. That was really good.